What is going on, everybody? It is Treeb from Treeb Talks here, and you know your boy likes to have a little fun every once in a while, and you know that there are some wild Jaguar fans out there, ladies and gentlemen. And today, what we are going to be doing is we are going to be impersonating every type of Jaguar fan. And now, if you are not aware of different types of Jaguar fans, and you obviously don't have Twitter, and you obviously don't have Facebook, and you obviously don't have Reddit, because literally all three of those Jags fans are different. Like, they all have different takes, and they all have different ways of expressing those takes, and we are going to be going over every single type of Jaguar fan in this video, ladies and gentlemen, so we're going to have a little bit of fun. So this is every type of Jaguar fan on the internet. You know who would not kneel for the national anthem? Tim Tebow. And this team kneeled during the national anthem. I could give a fuck less about all of these Jaguar players. If they're going to all kneel for the anthem, locking arms like they're doing a criminal act, disrespecting our troops, I will not be giving them a dollar of my money, no, 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 and I will boycott the NFL, and this will make a difference. Me not watching football will impact all of NFL's ratings, and I will not stick up for Colin Kaepernick and what he has done here in the NFL, changing all these people. They used to be respecting the troops, but now no one in the NFL respects the troops, and I respect the troops. No one hates 9-11 more than I do, and no one hates the NFL more than I do because I am boycotting. I hate the Jaguars, and I hate the NFL, and I hate Colin Kaepernick. Telvin Smith is a bitch. I cannot believe he just quit on the team like that. Do you want a player like that on your team? No. No, you don't. A guy that quits on you? No. Yeah, there's things bigger than football, but what do you get paid to do? You get paid to play football, and that is what you need to do. You signed a contract. I hate all these people that are posting pictures with, I stand with Telvin Smith. Where do you stand? On the bench? At home? Because that's where Telvin Smith is, and I will not stand for a quitter. No, I will not stand for Telvin Smith, and I will stand for the national anthem, though. Who here misses Blake Bortles? Raise your hand. He was never the problem. We, the, Our wide receivers dropped the ball every chance they got. We led the league in drops last year, and you guys cut the best quarterback we ever had in franchise history. How dare you? How dare you cut number five Blake Bortles? He's going to be going to the Los Angeles Rams and starting because he's obviously better than Jared Goff. He's the best quarterback we've ever had in franchise history. Look at the numbers. Crunch the numbers. Mark Brunel who? I don't know who that is. All I know who is BB5. And BB5 is the best quarterback in Jaguar war history and I'm still talking about him in this Facebook group to you even though everybody in the comments are going to get mad. Oh, I love Blake Bortles and I will never ever stop loving Blake Bortles. Can someone tell the admin to stop with these political posts? Just my new Jalen Ramsey edit. Did it myself this morning. Drop the mic. For the last time, it is not Jaguars, it's Jaguars. I don't know how many times I have to tell everybody that it's not Jaguars, it's Jaguars. Everybody, make sure you subscribe to my new podcast where we talk Jaguar football and we do all the latest film breakdown. I am an NFL expert that also lives in my mother's basement, but I did this film breakdown and I work for a website that no one has ever heard of. Follow me at hashtag jagson.com.net.url. Miles Jack was not down. We have six followers. Make sure you subscribe to the only elite Jaguar podcast podcast on the internet. Gardner Minshew is gonna take over the franchise, yeet, and that is me. I fucking hate Big Cat Country. All they do is shit on the Jaguars, and I will not let that happen. You need to show some respect to the players on the team. You guys are just always so negative all the time, and I will be boycotting Big Cat Country as I have a top fan badge by my name. I put my record before my Twitter handle so everyone knows that my favorite team has a losing record, and when we lose, I put sad by my name because I'm sad 2-4, and four, Treeb. Wait, what? We just beat the Jets? We're going... <laughs>
Jesus Christ. Wait, we beat the Jets? We're going to the Super Bowl. 3-0? and More like 16-0. and Don't even tread on me. Jags going all the way, baby. Oh, the Jags beat the Jets? Makes sense. That's probably the only team in the NFL we're better than. We're probably going to end up going 3-13 and and still fuck it up in the draft somehow. Has your quarterback won a Super Bowl MVP? I don't think so. We still need a tight end. I'm not subscribed to Treep Talks. I'm not subscribed to Treep Talks. You're not subscribed to Treep Talks? I'm not subscribed to Treep Talks. Who's Treep Talks? Oh, he's only the best Jaguar YouTuber on the planet. He posts six videos a week. Ain't nobody out working him. Them's are straight facts. Oh, I ought to subscribe to Treep Talks. I heard he just dropped a hilarious video imitating all the different types of Jags fans. Oh, why he sure god dang did there. You, you see UCF making that kind of content? No, only Treep Talks makes that kind of content. And that was me imitating all the different types of Jags fans. What'd you guys think? Leave your comments down below. Don't forget, you check links down below as well. You can like me on Facebook, at Troop Talks. Follow me on Twitter, at Troop Talks. Or follow me on Instagram, at Trey Von Pixley. Also, if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. Click the bell icon to get notified every single time I drop a new video. I drop new content on this channel six days a week. Ain't nobody out working me. Dems are just straight facts. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And as always, you guys have a great day.